What's going on guys and welcome to Dubhub. Today I will be showing you guys how you will be able to unlock the birthday cake back bling that will be coming to the game very very soon. Instead of just randomly improvising and talking about a bunch of stuff, I will be showing the Twitter page on screen and we can get all of our information from there. Alright guys, so looking over here we have this pinned tweet from Fortnite. This is obviously a big deal and it says July 24th is the hashtag Fortnite first birthday. For a limited time, you'll be able to earn celebratory birthday rewards by completing challenges and quests in game. So it says you can get more details here. So we're just going to go ahead and click on this and let's see what this is all about. So going down here, it says happy birthday, Fortnite fans. Starting July 24th, we'll be celebrating Fortnite first with a limited time in game event. You can earn special birthday cosmetics by completing birthday challenges and quests in-game. From the birthday battle pet bus to the exploder husks carrying his tasty surprise, we can't wait to party with you. The in-game celebration lasts until August 7th. So, this is really cool. I know a lot of people won't be able to believe that it's only been a year since Fortnite has been out. Um, but I mean, it happened, and yeah, so this is actually really cool. I like how they're doing this, and this is definitely a creative idea. Um... Let's go ahead and look at the rewards right here. The first one, to get it, you have to play 14 matches, and it looks like it will give you 5,000 XP, which is actually pretty cool. I think you get 5,000 XP for doing normally four challenges each week, so this is a really cool extra boost that you can get, and it will definitely help you out in the long run for your grind for the Drift and Ragnarok skins. Now, looking at the next one, it looks like just an emoticon that your character can, you know, like throw up in the air. Deal damage to opponents, that is not very hard to do, and it's only 1,000, so that's relatively easy as well now this one this next one might be the one that ends up hurting people because it is the dance in front of different birthday cakes and there are 10 of them so i'm assuming it'll be like say no dancing signs and stuff like that where you're gonna have to you know go across the map and visit different locations and dance in front of them which is always a pain so it may take a little while to get this but this is a spray paint that you can unlock for this but People really won't be going for the spray paint. What they'll be going for is a birthday cake backling that you can see in the top right corner of that image. And this means that everyone will be able to unlock this back bling as long as they can complete these challenges in the allotted time slot. But this also means that eventually the skin, or not the skin, that back bling could actually eventually be like an OG skin because next year, um, probably different people playing the game, you know, some people get bored of it and new people come into the game and not everyone may have this back bling because it will be a limited time thing. Once you do not unlock it, you never have the chance to unlock it again. So everyone should be going for this skin right now because it could end up being decently rare. And even for the 5,000 XP, this is an easy way that you can get 1% of the Ragnarok maxed out. Um, this is just really cool. I like how Epic Games has incorporated this because it's not necessarily like really a holiday but it's still the birthday of the game and I, I really like how they're always trying to add new things into the game if you guys are kind of confused on what the challenges are you can see at the bottom of this image you can go ahead and pause the video but it lists out the challenges there too and it says it pretty clearly so this is what you guys are going to have to do to get the birthday cake black bling and that's pretty much it thank you guys so much for watching make sure you don't forget to hit that subscribe button on the way out and make sure you also comment and tell me what I should cover next in regards to Fortnite or a question that you need answering. Thank you guys so much and I'll see you later.